Back out at Kodak, Tennessee, covering the Southern League this week for Minor League Baseball. Melanie Newman today joined by one of the Diamondbacks' own Kevin Crone. Now, Kevin, you actually come from one of several families that's all involved in the Diamondbacks organization. What is it like to have your dad in? Yeah, it's something that's that's something we've always dreamed about. Um, my brother playing professional baseball as well. Um, just something we've always dreamed about, you know, being able to be on the same field together whenever he comes into town. Um, you know, him watching me play and – <clears throat> being able to learn from from someone who's been doing it a long time and, and happens to be my dad so it's been a it's been a cool experience so far now you mentioned your brother cj crone playing for the angels growing up was there ever any type of competition or comparison between the two of you uh, more comparison from people on the other end but us we're, we're very competitive and um you know growing up playing different games with each other in the backyard doing just just about anything we can to compete with one another but um, you know, I'm his, I'm his biggest fan, and he's my biggest fan, and we were pulling for each other. And um, you know, it's it's awesome to be able to have that have, have that relationship. Now, he is also frequently playing the infield, similar to you. Is there ever any advice that he passes down to you as he racks up some time in the bigs? Yeah, I mean, he gets to learn from guys like Albert Pujols, and um, you know, obviously Mike Trout, even though he's maybe even young, younger, older than Mike Trout. But um, you know, he gets to learn from some of the guys that are the best in the business. So just you know, listening how they how they interact with each other and. Um, just the, just the conversations that go on at the big league level. That's something I try to, you know, involve with me and my teammates, just trying to learn from each other. And, um, you know, that's, that's kind of the extent of it. You mentioned your teammates. You're a part of a pretty young squad here this year at the double a level. You've only gotten, um, part of a series under your belt so far. What have you really taken in this week? Um, you know, it's definitely a different game up in double a compared to, you know, the a ball and, and the other levels I've played at, um, you know, the guys just have a better idea of who they are as a person. That's kind of the biggest thing is just knowing who they are and, and what they do well and what they don't do well and, um, you know, playing to their own strength. So I guess on a hitter side of it, um, pitchers kind of understand what they're trying to do to you a little bit better. And obviously as the season goes on and they know a little bit more about you facing you every more and more. Um, but it just seems like they have a little bit better idea of what they're trying to do. So you got to kind of be uh, more locked into your approach and know who you are and, and, and try to just beat them that way. As you get locked into that approach, would you say you've made any more adjustments on the mental or the physical side of the game? Um, I mean, it was still early. Um, there's obviously adjustments to be made, and, and you're starting to get – the further you go into the season, the bigger sample size you get and, and how you've um, performed and, and what you need to do to adjust to play at this level. And, um, you know, I'm still learning, still trying to figure out what, what I need to do to make myself better day to day in and day out. But um, as of now, still trying to just learn, you know, what's um, – how I'm going to approach going after the double-A pitchers. Well, hopefully you'll have that right approach today again. Thank you. Absolutely. No problem. Again, with Mobile Bay Bears infield position player Kevin Crone for Mobile Bay Bears and Southern League Baseball, this is Melanie Newman.